Hi everyone, me again uh, with what I'm calling a Tuesday tip, which is a, a little bit of advice for young writers out there. And by young, I mean maybe 12 year olds up to 20 year olds or something like that. So basically people who are starting in the, in, who are enjoying their writing and maybe want to go a little bit further with it and, um, and get some advice from an author. So, okay, here is my very first Tuesday tip, and it is make your hero suffer. These are all on my website, but I'm gonna add a little bit to them. So I'll read you what it says on my website, and then I'll talk around it a little bit too. Uh, make your hero suffer. There's nothing a reader likes more than seeing someone suffer than triumph. We love watching people find their way through really difficult times. We learn a lot from that and we gain a great deal of inspiration. So give your hero the hardest time you can possibly conjure and then show us how they get through it or don't. That's up to you and whatever the story demands. Now, when I started writing stories, I wanted to write about nice people doing nice things in a nice way. And my stories were very boring as a consequence of that. It's only when I realized that I had to be really rough on my poor protagonist or main character that the story started getting interesting. Now that was scary because you know what? If you get them into trouble, you've got to get them out of trouble. And sometimes it's really difficult to think of how to get them out of that trouble you've just put them into. But that's what an author's meant to do. You're meant to find the brilliant way that gets them out of the difficulty they're in. And the more trouble you put them in, the higher the stakes, the greater the interest the reader has in finding out how you brilliantly get them out of this incredibly difficult situation. And when you see someone who perhaps is likable, as a lot of protagonists, main characters are, if you see someone who's likable overcome a really great difficulty, then you know what? It fills you up with hope. It makes you feel really excited for life. <laughs> that, you know, whatever troubles you get into, perhaps uh, there, there's going to be a way out if you can just think of it. So, you know, watching people struggle through difficulties and get through them and triumph is, uh, fills us with hope and fills us with ideas and uh, kind of really helps us through life. It's kind of equipment for living. So be brave and make your hero suffer.